Well, it, it all stemmed from uh, my uh, maternal great uncle's uh, estate. And uh, when, uh, in his will, he wrote that he wanted whatever money was left to be given to students to help them, you know, in college or graduate school, whatever. So uh, there was a scholarship fund set up, the J. Jacob and Daisy H. Lee Memorial Fund, you know, after he pays, that was in his will. And for, uh, I, uh, I was asked to be one of the trustees and I also managed the finances. Okay. That was finally turned over to me. And over the course of that time, we helped 32 students with their expenses in college. Many times they just needed books, sometimes they needed supplies, sometimes they needed additional, you know, funds, you know, to enter the school. So after about, you know, maybe 10 or 12 years, I spoke right up and said, no, I have another idea. And it was then that I thought about copying, you know, because I had such a wonderful education there. And my cousin uh, uh, finished Morgan, so I called Coppin and, you know, they said, yes, they would accept whatever, you know, and the same thing happened at Morgan. So I brought it back to the committee and they agreed. So this is when we decided to give more than $100,000 and topping $100,000. And by the way, that topping, uh, was, it was matched two to one. So that scholarship should always be in place for $300,000. So, you know, I feel just so great that I had that experience or the opportunity to, you know, help the students who come to Coppin. My name is Isokit Ogabor. I'm a senior here at Coppin State University, and I'm an elementary education major. During the summer, I had to take a summer course, and I assumed that my job would pay for it, um, and that was not the case because I was still, you know, in my six-month period. So I contacted my advisor, and he told me to apply for a private donor award. And I said, okay, I mean, why not? Like, what do I have to lose? When I was writing my essay for the scholarship, I did not really think about winning anything. I was just being honest with my writing and just telling about my experience as a college student and a mom. I am very appreciative of this program because for a couple years, I've had to figure out how to pay for school. But this past semester, when I checked my account, and I saw that, you know, my tuition would be this amount and I didn't have that, but I had the scholarship which would balance it out. I was so relieved. The scholarship really helped me, you know, be able to continue school and just continue on my path to success. Thank you to my donors, Mr. Winky and Mrs. Peaches, Mrs. Luvinia M. Drain, and Mrs. Ethel, and Mr. Glenn Plunkett. You all are an inspiration and you inspire students like myself to always lend a helping hand. I am grateful and honored to have received this blessing.